trying to make this deployment, you know, the best opportunity possible for myself and also for the people around me on this team. So I want to do everything I possibly can to make this this team better and keep everyone prepared to make myself better too while I'm out here. Diagnose. He's just been known as Doc Brute. Every time that we go down there, they always bring it up. Doc Brute. And they say that he has an outstanding mustache. <laughs> Um, you know, Petty Officer Chris is never really concerned about awards. He's never really concerned about getting accolades. That's just that's just a byproduct of his character. I mean, HM3 Chris, uh, you know, he's he's really a rock star. You know, our medical section is doing a phenomenal job. You know, and, and he specifically, you know, and it's uh, it's it's really inspiring. I've definitely appreciated making some friends with the uh, with the A and A medics and that. They're really, really, they're great guys. It's it's an honor to work alongside of them, especially to see the guys that really want to see a change in their country. So it's been eye opening. He's highly respected by them. value his opinion when it comes to any anything that has to do with medical trauma related preventive medicine related and training related music has always been a part of my life it's an easy way to kind of just forget about what's going on I got Mr. Potato Head one day when I was feeling a little kooky and I made it look like me so he's my buddy uh, I like to keep morale high. I like to always joke around, and I like to be—I I like to always be somebody that the Marines will come to, either for a laugh, whatever they need. He's a great guy to work with. Uh, I—I've been in charge of many, many uh, second classes and below. He by how far outshines them all. It's—it's. It's, I am tight. It's always an adventure. <laughs> It's an adventure.